So in English, if we say someone has a green thumb, uh, it doesn't mean that their thumb uh, is actually green, okay? It doesn't mean that they took a marker and that they colored uh, their thumb green. What it means in English, if you say that someone has a green thumb, is that they are really, really good at growing things. My wife, Jen, has a green thumb. She is really good at growing flowers. If you watch some of my other videos, you will have seen all of the flowers that we grow uh, and that we sell. So she definitely has a green thumb. If there was an opposite word or an opposite description for green thumb, that would be me. I'm good at driving tractors. I'm good at fixing things, but I'm not that good at growing things. I actually don't really have a green thumb, uh, but Jen definitely does. So if you say someone has a green thumb, it means they're really good at growing things. We also have another phrase in English, to be caught red-handed. When you're caught red-handed, it doesn't mean that you took a red marker and you colored your hand red. Uh, if you're caught red-handed, it means that you're caught doing something probably illegal uh, in the act of doing it. So a good example of this would be, um, oh, my red marker is rolling away. Uh, a good example of this would be maybe you broke into a vending machine you smashed the front of a vending machine and you were taking candy out of the vending machine after you broke into the front and the police drove up as you were doing it and caught you stealing candy. That would mean that you were caught red-handed. You were caught red-handed in the act of actually stealing the candy. Hopefully you guys didn't actually do that. <laughs>